Good morning, YouTube. It is October 28th, I think, Monday, and um, there are a lot of changes in store for us. So, first of all, um, we are turning in our two weeks of resignation for um, our positions at DTSS and Brisk and Brisk Works and whatever other companies that would potentially be involved in here. Um, we are going to be starting our own marketing company. Um, I'm going to get into the details more on that later, but uh, so today is the the big announcement for that so we're going to see what happened um you know what actually so for a while that we've had disagreements and I, i've alluded to them i feel like more than I actually gone into the, the real nitty-gritty on this just because i i wanted to i don't know if it was like i didn't want to necessarily share the problems that were going on but it just always because this is kind of like a, it's obviously a very public forum, and it's not like a whole bunch of people are watching this, but uh, it, it feels more like you should keep some of those things inside the business and not necessarily be sharing them with the whole world. But um, we've had a variety of disagreements on how the marketing should be going. And um, Jealousy and I have been doing our hard best and, and working our hardest to make sure that we do the marketing according to the research, according to... Um, what we think people are actually looking at according to the analytics not just based off of feelings and our boss has wanted to do the 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 posts and stuff according to what he feels is best um, not that there aren't a lot of people who are great feelers and then therefore able to make really good decisions about uh, an aspect of business that they know very little about however um, it doesn't, most rational decisions don't work like that. And so, um, in spite of the fact that I could show proof that our strategies and ideas were attracting a fair amount of attention, um, despite the fact that we hadn't been putting money into any marketing campaigns for a long time, and so we were just going purely on organic reach, despite the fact that there were a variety of those sort of things, um, Stacy, who was the C C O, and I think I talked about her quite a few times in this, she is no longer with the company. And because of that, we no longer have that buffer. And so instead of communicating with Stacy about ideas and stuff, we're now communicating straight again with Brett. And Brett is got the he he's got a very different idea of how he'd like to run the marketing program. And it's his company. And so I got into this because I wanted to document all the trials and tribulations of starting your own company and all the tips that I could give and all the ideas I could give. And then when I found this company, I thought, oh, this is a great opportunity. They're a couple of years down the road and I can just jump in and grow it and not have to worry about all of the aspects of the company. I could just focus on the marketing thing and they're already further along. But unfortunately, if you're not the owner of the company, you don't get to make all the decisions. And not that all my decisions will be right, but they'll be mine. And so, we're starting our own marketing company. We're going to um, talk to dentists about dentist uh, marketing. We're going to talk to staffing companies about staffing marketing. And we're going to talk to software companies about marketing for their software. Because turns out I've got a fair amount of experience now with those three areas. So, that is our plan. We're, we have not gotten the LLC. We've not done any of the, the stuff that this is a very new decision. We've been thinking about like doing some contract work for marketing for a while, but we're going to go full steam into it. Um, we're going to see how that goes, and I'll have more information about what's going on. So, be bold, be disciplined, inspire others. More on everything later. Have a good day.